Thousands of tri-staters lined up at convenience stores today to purchase Mega Millions tickets with tonight's near-record jackpot. Many more are pitched in through office pools. But if you did, we have some words of caution. The lottery machine was running round the clock today at this Mount Washington convenience store. <laughs> Customers like Jacob Brakefield were already planning what they would do if they won the $600 million near-record jackpot. All right, what are you going to do if you win? I'm going to spread the wealth, give it to you know charities, going around town, help homeless people. Many were taking the team approach and joining coworkers in an office pool. You like going in with other people? Yeah, pretty nice. Mm -hmm. But it'd be nice to hit it, so I'm excited. But if you do that, beware. There have been cases of fights, ended friendships, even major lawsuits in office pools gone bad. So Forbes magazine offers the following rules. Have a written list of everyone participating and post or email it. That way there are no questions as to who's in. Make Xerox copies of all tickets so no one can claim they won with a personal ticket. If you win, will the group go public or stay anonymous? And if you win a smaller amount, will you take the cash or reinvest it? That way there are no hard feelings if that ticket is any sort of winner. Aha, if you don't see me here tomorrow, that means that one of those tickets I bought was the winner. Finally, it's Tuesday and time for our app of the week. And this week, a new business review app. It's getting very good reviews. It's called Wisely. It has ratings based on credit card transactions and then how many customers return to the business, which means they like the business. What's the advantage of it? This way, employees and competitors can't stack the deck with fake reviews, which is a very common problem with business review sites. Wisely and other apps of the week are on WCPO.com so you don't waste your money.